when the Lord saw, when the Lord saw, when the Lord saw, when the Lord saw, when the Lord saw that she was unloved. When the Lord saw, not people, when the Lord saw. Is it when the Lord saw that she was unloved, he opened up her womb. Now right there, anybody that's really connected to the kingdom should get excited. Because anytime you know you've got some haters, God is responsible to open up your womb and make you fruitful. In fact, most of the people that don't want to see you make it are the midwives that push out of you what God has impregnated you with. I'm glad you talked about me. If it wasn't for you, I wouldn't have learned how to praise God by myself. Wait, wait, wait. That's, that's, that's not really the proper hermeneutical construct of the text, though, because there's something psychological that goes on that she needs to be rebuked of. And everybody needs somebody to correct them. When they become overly attached to folk, that are not good for them. Yeah, yeah. Lord, I feel like preaching in this house. And y'all not know sometimes folk leaving you ain't a bad thing. I'm going to say that one more time. Folk leaving you, leaving your church, leaving your ministry, leaving your life is not a bad thing. Some folk walking away from you is not satanic, it's not demonic, it is orchestrated by God. Christian Page, where you get that from? Do y'all remember in the book of Acts, there was a man named Paul? He had a, a companion called Barnabas. And Barnabas had a cousin named John Mark. And the Bible said they leave Antioch of Pisidia to go on the first missionary tour. And the Bible said midway on the tour, John Mark cannot handle adversity and pressure. He gets off the boat and goes back home. When Paul and Barnabas got back to Antioch of Pisidia, they're setting up the second missionary tour, and the Bible says, Barnabas says to Paul, let's take John Mark with us. Paul looked at John Mark and said, he ain't going nowhere with me. The text then said, they had sharp contention. That word contention in the Greek means they had an argument, they had a falling they split. Paul picked Silas. They went and did ministry. Barnabas took Mark and they went and did ministry. There's a time when you've got to separate from people that are not going in the same prophetic direction as you. Some of y'all are holding on to people that are spiritual parasites and leeches and they're sucking up everything God has given you. So you ain't ready for the next dimension until you are satisfied and happy by yourself. If you need somebody pat you on your back, telling you that you're going to make it, you are not spiritually mature. So what? They don't like you. So what? They won't support you. They ain't saying you know how. I feel like preaching up in here now. So what? They won't get with your program. Some folk can't get with the program because God is not going to let them get the credit for your next promotion. You got the walk by Psychologically, it says that the Lord opened up her womb and she was fruitful. Right? The text says. But the text says Rachel was bad. The one voted most likely to succeed could not bear children. Now let me help all of y'all out in here. The church is always characterized metaphorically as a woman. Thank you. 
you a click.